Time to press ahead. Poison sprays. Uh. Uh, apparently, Astarian isn't doing. Ah, he could actually shoot that one. We have firebolt as well. So why not? Ouch. They have they got, got a temporary hit points, which is not not fun. But so let's see. Twenty uh, twenty three hit points, and I can do. Okay, but then again they are kind of avoiding the targets, so avoiding the terrain, so it's it's pretty pretty okay. Idea. Magic missile is still a good good thing. We have been using it since <laughs> from the nineteen eighties and it's still good. Okay, he's frightened. Okay, he seemed mobile. Oh no, they are frightened. Can we get a drop on that guy? Yes. That was good damage. But That's a critical hit, that's the wrong place for critical hit, but... Uh, dazed. Okay, what's, what's that? Thunder Wave is pretty bad. Ah. 
Mystic Call of Miss. Oh no. Hamstring. That was good hit. She, she was bit a, a bit dazed, but anyway. So what's this? Uh, eight. Okay. So I can improve her hit points. Don't make me hurt them. Apparently, friendly the fire isn't a thing. Yeah, we, we got some damage. So there's lots of that, lots of that mist, and it's poisons, poisons. So I can't actually climb there. What if I jump past it? That's a lot of hit points. And I can actually disarm these vents. So what would... Okay, Astarion, that's not what I wanted you to do. Hmm. And we didn't have anything that makes rain. This step is useful. No one back home will ever believe this. Now we can do the misty step as well. Step. There, in the cage. Trap. You. I, I, you. I, stop it. Okay, she's she's still winning, winning the initiative. Got long. If you 
none to save her. At least those mirror images are not taking much of much of damage. More, more critical hits, please. Let's light them up. stuff around. Not enough space. Um. As you wish. Okay, I, I <laughs> managed to extinguish it. <laughs> Dina fire. I yeah. Guess he's over there. No, not in, not invincible. Or invi invisible. My faith will protect me. Focus, strike true. <laughs> yeah, kind of, kind of guess that. I speak, they burn. Okay. Thank you. 
Vai? Ai, klikki tie, tisen. I was in last time I was in the correct place. There's slightly sketchy movement sometimes in this game. Iltaa, iltaa. Tässä on vähän hankalampi taistelu menossa. Noita vastaan seikkailija porukka. Perustuu tosi elämään. She, she, she likes to attack Asterion for some reason. And Asterion didn't even get a... ...attack on her. Attack of opportunity. Okay. So, so much for poison spray. No choice but to keep going. Light on my feet. Critical hit. How do you like that? <laughs> She's totally out of the, out of battle. Okay, she's just in the, in the range of attacks. Wait! Oh, ah! Wait just a tick! Killing me is a waste of time. Oh, now you, no, now, now you are. No way to return. Negotiating. Always will. But it's unpleasant. So how about we be civilized about this? Mm hmm. Hmm. I have something you want. You wound me, sweetie. My offer will put that little pact of yours to shame. Let me leave with the girl, and I'll give you power. You want to be stronger, tougher? Smart. Ability <laughs> score plus one. <laughs> okay. Just let me keep the girl and her babe. Not only would this be a vile deal, it would be folly to trust the hag's gifts. It's your choice, sweetness. The human means nothing to me. Uh, okay, I, I could be really evil. The, although this is Seldarin. I, I think this is just draw. Both the draw factions actually would would say this. Could could say this. I think the dead hack is the answer here. Astarion disapproves. Why? 
She has been trying to kill you. Ouch. Ouch. Critical hit. How you like that? So let's see, one to ten. She has seven hit points. Make it hurt. That 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 worked. How can I have trusted her? Lap of lapse of judgment. Monster, my child. Yeah, accidents happen. <laughs> Why the hell you That's would even consider it. that? My baby! And God, I was going to do it for him. Well, uh, okay. She was going to bring ah. her back. Bring God Necromancy is always censor. Not really. Connor would have done anything to save me. I had to do the same. Uh, not that anything. It's my own fault for letting her. Look, I don't like owing people. Here, this socket is worth some coin. Really? I started this approach. That's. My husband gave it to me. I should take him home. His coffin is just upstairs. A decent burial is the least I can give him. Thank you. Yeah, I don't think there's anyone else who would have saved me. He's dead. What? How? How am I still breathing? I've the bite. I wouldn't wish it on anyone. Your insides end up on the outside. Petrification stops the spread. I was on death's door, but now I feel. I feel great. I wonder why. How? Just. He detects traces of decaying magic within him, likely the cause of his disease. But that doesn't make a lick of sense. The bite ain't magical. Unless. Yep, you have been scammed. Double crossing, filthy, lying hag. Very dead hat hag. Me, it me sick, and then trap me in stone for kicks. Angry dwarf. I left me wife, me kids behind for fear of infecting them. They were only babes. The stones know how old they are now. Only because of you. I... I ain't got no way to repay you. No. What you've done for me and mine today won't be forgotten. Thank you. What's hiding here? Simple toxin. Ah, there was this guy. Is the hack gone? God, tell me. 
me, she's gone. Oh, please. May she burn in the nine hells. The things she did. The things she made me do. Although you might oh, have m imagined most of them. Disgusting. Good gods. You. You're the one. The mind flayer. No. The hag's gift is gone, but it's... It's going to happen. Soon. I saw you screaming. Covered in your own insides as that... That thing bursts out of your skull. You change. Skin ripping from your body and then you butcher... Everyone. Everyone around you. I... I don't know. Could be a ten day. Could be any moment. I can't do this. You're too dangerous. I'm. I'm sorry. So grateful. Okay, how do I get out from here? So who else? Always a delight to speak with you. What can I do? Ah, yes. Carsus. Carsus was perhaps the most powerful wizard that ever lived. The child who would be a god, the elves called him. And he tried. With a spell of his own devising, he endeavored to usurp in one fell swoop the power of the goddess of magic. Mistril, she was called then. Imagine what it must have felt like to be a god. To know yourself, to be untouchable. To be mistaken. As Carsus aimed his spell at her, she began to unravel. And with her, the entire weave. Too late did he realize what he had unleashed. It would have been the end of everything had not Mistril sacrificed herself. The goddess of magic is all magic. By dying, the entire weave was lost, and the spell that challenged a god failed. It was the end of Mistral, the end of Carsus, and the end of an entire civilization. As the child who would be a god was turned to stone, his empire came crashing down around him. The floating cities of Netheril were no more, an event that came to be known as Carsus's folly. For a spell, Mistral was reborn as Mistra. Upon her return, the weave returned with her. Now, so many centuries later, I try to follow in the footsteps of Carsus. Not to destroy Mistra, but to prove my love for her. I try to control only a fraction of the magic that was unleashed that fateful day. I merely sought to return one tiny diamond to an imperfect crown. Gale's folly, one might call it. History. Repetition. It's the way things go. If it should ever come to that, if I ever know I am no longer able to stop it, I will do anything I can to ensure no one but me pays for my mistakes. I will find the remotest place on the surface of Faerun, or perhaps far below in the depths of the Underdark. I will await that death alone. I promise I will not betray your trust. You kept me by your side despite the menace that I am. If worse comes to worst, I will be long gone before the curtain falls. I know what it is to hunger. And I know what it takes to keep that hunger under control. He's done that so far, despite his condition. So long as he sates his appetite elsewhere, I'm happy to give him the benefit of the doubt. Oh, I was surprised, but pleasantly so, just like I said, amid the madness that has befallen us. It seems almost out of place to think of a kiss. And yet, now more than ever, it's important to recall what makes us human. Well, you know what I mean. 
a stolen glance, that sudden heartbeat. Sometimes the little things are worth more than kingdoms. They promise things to come. I'll give it a shot. In in today. <laughs> you carry a Githyanki relic. I will have an extra. Ah, uh, oops, oops. Oh, Walk away now. I won't warn you again. That artifact is an heirloom of my people. Likely she spilled Githyanki blood in order to steal it. This cannot stand. Heirloom? Plunder from some conquered realm, more like. This artifact is the only thing keeping us from becoming slaves to our parasites. Be glad I have it. Lozel thinks I have something important to her people. She's deluded, clear lies. She carries an heirloom of my people. I must know why. Uh, she, she was told to by Shar to uh, steal it. You hear that, Lazel? It's called common sense. Tsk. You seek reason and dishonor. I doubt this one's wit will be any sharper by then. I do not wish to spill blood here. Come daylight, we will find a place to end this. Fine. You can accept your wrong, or we'll be rid of you permanently. Either way, I win. Okay. You had every chance to look the other way. But here we are. You chose this. Spare me the justifications, coward! If anyone asks, I'll say you were transforming. Don't expect to be mourned. So no hard stop, you don't have to do this. These, these are people are always fighting. Okay, and of course I'm Well at least that that's ten. She's a liability. It's the artifact we need, not her. Let me up, and I'll show you. Can I do that, Lazel? Can I turn my back on you? Never. Thieves aren't afforded such luck. Loosen the grip on your pride for one blasted moment, won't you? We needn't be enemies. There's plenty of those to go around already. What would you have? That we be friends? I thought that would be a good idea. Imagine what we might achieve if we channeled some of that hostility back at our real foes, instead of each other. They wouldn't stand a chance. No, that's, that's actually a point. So... We can we can help help her somehow. There's something I want to talk to you about. Something important. Okay. I could have died in that pod back on the Nautiloid. 
You could have died, spending precious moments trying to free me, but you did it anyway. I owe you my life. Twice over, in fact. You supported me against Lazel. I may not have survived that night without you. I'm trying to say... Oh, she got, she got proves. I trust in a way very few ever have. I want that to mean something. I want you to know more about me. At least from what I can remember. As long as I prayed to Lady Shah, I wish to serve her as a dark justice here. Okay, dark justice. And scarcely a greater way to fully dedicate yourself to Lady Shah, save perhaps if you become the head of her church. To become a dark justice here is to become the Night Singer's sword arm. Her implement with which she will cast down the unbelievers and win the final battle to restore her perfect, endless darkness. It's all I ever wanted. I prayed it was my calling. But Mother forbid me from seeking to prove myself worthy of the rank. She said I was not ready. Not my mother, Mother, I should add. The Mother Superior. Head of Lady Shah's enclave in Baldur's Gate. Sometimes I wonder if she would ever deem me ready. I owe her everything, and I only wish to serve, yet she can prove inscrutable. Do you think she'll ever relent and make you a Dark Justicar. I, I think the first first option is all always, well, well, not always. Most most of the time, pretty pretty sensible. I don't know. Perhaps if I succeed in my mission and reach Baldur's Gate, hope has little place amongst Lady Shah's children. It's an illusion, a distraction. But for this. I hope my time will yet come. Dark Justicias are hated by many, judged to be ruthless fanatics. Even the few who would accept a follower of Lady Shah would likely bulk at a Justicia in their midst. But there's a simpler answer to your question. I simply forgot about the desire I had until I saw some things that reminded me. Now, I can't get it out of my mind. <laughs> well, that was load of nothing. Uh, thank you for sharing. Want to talk about what happened with Daisy? Well, dear friends now, if that's what you're asking. Yeah. But I trust we can all sleep a little more soundly in camp now. Best defenses, attack, or something. Relax. We'll kiss and make up on our own time. Uh -huh. Someone prodding at a newly opened wound doesn't help matters. Okay, so we can we can actually help her. Essence of Silvan stop. Okay, so there's This is this is the hobby room, clear, clearly. Peak's head. Portion of speed. Ever seeing eye, what's ever seeing eye? Protection from evil and good. What's next? Lost in thought. No time to rest. Mm. I have your taste. Trust no Pro Protection for the T4 mage would is is pretty okay. What to do? 
bitter divorce. What a day. Connor. Don't linger. Is that blood? No, never mind. With magic. Staff of Crawls. Might be useful. Hmm. So it's a quarter stuff, so this is something that Gail could be using. So it's like uh, the spell sparker is giving a slight boost on the damage. Two lightning charges. But this would be like ray of sickness. Spell, why not? I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll abide. Butterflies in stomach. Bonus action, single use. Okay, so e e each of these <laughs> potions have a the name of their own. Faltering will, broken promises, lost time, will the dreams, earthen battle. Okay. So each of these are actually giving a bonus action of some sort. Circle. Okay. Moldering coffin. Something's on my mind. Gods, didn't hear you coming. I know I should head home, but I can't bring myself to leave. The thought of putting him in a wheelbarrow and making the journey all over again. Uh, found a vent. I think I can resurrect your husband. <laughs> this is so bad idea. You feel a surge of power from the wand. The air suddenly tastes acrid. It wants to be used. Bring it back. Bring Connor back. Please. Yep. What? What's happening? Why is he still dead? Uh, yeah, because necromancy really doesn't solve anything. Yep. Dear husband. You feel something pull at you. The creature yearns for a master. <laughs> Let's bury him again. <laughs>
Okay, so... Ah, uh, now she's... What? She's protecting the zombie. Okay, let's load this. That that was stupid. <laughs> I mean, really stupid. Okay, maybe maybe it, it would be good thing to be a, a little wise. Maybe not to try try the necrom stuff on necromancy when we actually know that know that nothing good is going out of there. Yeah, let's snap the band because that's that's the wise decision here. I suppose some people can go crazy, crazy, crazy with the grief, but it's it's not letting go is part of the normal normal sorrow. Why are you coming? I know we should head home, but I can't bring myself to leave. The thought of putting him in a wheelbarrow and making the journey all over again. What? You feel a surge of power from the wand. The air suddenly tastes acrid. It wants to be used. Bring it back. Well, a, Bring a funny back. fact from the Please. from the lady that is actually uh, I know no no noting the game. She actually made it uh, those recordings during the pandemic from her home studio, which is great. Snap the wand into. Yeah, we are, we are helping. Complete. 